ChatGPT versus Gemini. Which one of these AI tools can recreate Roblox's Steel of Brain Rod better? Alrighty, so we're going to start with ChatGPT. And as of recording this video, Gemini 3 has just released, and I heard it's the most powerful AI model out there right now. So I'm really curious to see if Gemini can make a better Roblox game than ChatGPT can. So I want to make a simple recreation of and what I'm also going to do is use this extended thinking feature so that hopefully ChatGPT can think for longer and make a better product. We're going to see. Go ChatGPT, go! Think! Think for once in your life! Think, Mark! Think! Alrighty, here's the PDF file. It is documented very nice, so I'm just going to follow all of these steps. Now, you might notice that there's no comments this time, and that's because I asked it to not give comments because that was- <laughs> That was screwing me over last time! Okay, I have followed ChatGPT's instructions, so now let's test the game and see what the game looks like right now. Uh <laughs> What, what was I expecting? Honestly, honestly, what was I expecting? <laughs> oh my gosh. What are these things? Are these the brains? Why is there parts like, oh my goodness. We got points and we got brains and we got sprint and protection. Oh my goodness. This is not what steal a brain rot is at all. Chat GBT, you're so stupid. <laughs> okay, this is a long prompt, but I, I think I actually have to spoon feed chat GBT like a baby because apparently it can't do research on Roblox Steel of Brain Rot. It just can't. I can't believe ChatGPT took Steel a Brain Rot, literally. <laughs> These are brains. You have the grab tool and you steal them for points. All right, so this is the second iteration. We had to start over, but let's see if this game works. And it looks like there's a bug again. Like, we are almost halfway there and we like barely have anything. We have like nothing, bro. ChatGPT is actually doing work worse this time than the 99 nights video oh my gosh how is this possible 70 years later all right let's test this game and let's hope that there are no bugs all right so there are no bugs oh wait never mind there are bugs i gotta fix them three days later um any more bugs let's see if we can find any more bugs oh oh my goodness look we we, we actually got brain rots that are spawning from one place to the next okay can i buy them all right, buy this. Oh, let's go. I successfully purchased a brain rot. Okay, so it looks like the, the proximity prompt is still here though, but it looks like our money is actually going up. And if I buy another one of these commons, then it's just going to go over to my base. But let's see if I can buy one of these uh, rare ones. So how much is this one? Oh, I, I can't even see how much this is. Oh, it's 200. Uh, I'm almost at 200. So here's an uncommon. I'm going to buy this uncommon. Yes, sir. We have bought the uncommon and now we're making so much money. It looks like I can topple these over as well. Oh, that's pretty funny. <laughs> okay, so the goal here is I'm going to add the cell functionality and change the proximity prompt behavior. <laughs> what are these names? Ohio Goober, Mild Skibbity, Baby Rizzler. Let's look at the legendaries. We got Omega Rizzlord, Elder Skibbity Deity. <laughs> Ascended Sigma, Divine Phantom, Supreme Ohio B. Yo, what? All right, let's uh, look at the game. Let's see if the cell functionality works. Are these named? Oh yeah, look, we got Baby Rizzler. Let's go. Okay, all right, so we have some more functionality. Let's uh, see if we can add some more stuff. Okay, so we had a really bad start, but now it looks like we're actually starting to pick up the pace, thankfully. <laughs> I want to make the brain rots not look like freaking parts, okay? <laughs> That's like uh, my goal here. I don't want to make these look like parts. So I have about 20 four minutes. So let's see if we can make these brain rots actually look like brain rots. Let's search a brain rot. Let's see if a brain rot pulls up. Okay. So we have the six, seven brain rot working. All right. We'll, we'll take the six, seven brain rot. One week later. Please work. No errors, please. Oh, yo, wait, what are these guys doing? What? Um, excuse me, but do you have to go back to elementary school? Do you not know what a single file line is? <laughs> okay, there we go. So it looks like it now fixed itself. Yo, six, seven. <laughs> the proximity prompts are, are not working though. Why why are the proximity prompts not working? Okay, I, I want to do this bug fix, fix, but we have 14 minutes. So I want to very quickly fix this so that I can finally add some more features. <laughs> okay, so I think it finally works now. So if we were to test this out, there's still moving like crazy but uh okay so let's buy this common let's go i captured six seven let's freaking go although it's kind of like <laughs> 
<laughs> it kind of looks weird, but all right, I'm going to capture you. I'm going to capture you and I'm going to capture you. Oh, I, I can't afford you, apparently. So just as a finishing touch, I'm going to see if I can create the slapper tool because that is in every single steal a blank type of game. So uh, this would not be a steal a brain rot game if I didn't have that. Yeah, there's still just one base. I, I don't know why it's doing this, but there still is just one base. We have 30 freaking seconds. That is amazing. Okay, so time is up, but I'm going to go a little past it, just a little bit. I'm honestly kind of disappointed in ChatGPT this round. So I had to revert back to a previous version because the new one was literally breaking the game. So I am going to show you what ChatGPT has whipped up in the last hour. So what we're going to see here is a bunch of these six, seven brain rots that are for some reason have like really weird pathfinding. What happens is if you go up to them, they're going to have different rarities. So you, as you can see, this one's an uncommon and I can buy this. Let's try and buy this one. So this is a common and look at that purchase successful. I bought a common. These guys do not have their own names. Unfortunately, they do not have Skibbity Rizzler or Omega, whatever the heck. I don't even know what they were called. If you sell it, then you earn your money back and that earns a slot for you inside this game. And there's also the slapper tool, which um, opens up like this for some reason. Why am I holding it on the backside? I don't know. That's so weird, but it, of course, doesn't really work if I try it. So that is quite unfortunate. So yeah, this is what ChatGPT whipped up in one hour. Let me know what you rate this in the comments. I would give this a two out of 10. I actually think this is terrible <laughs> because we don't even have plots. We don't have player plots. We don't have the stealing functionality. Anyways, let's move on to Gemini. Okay, so I'm going to start the timer again. Big problem with ChatGPT was it failed to understand what steel brain rot was when it did its initial research. So I literally had to spoon feed information into ChatGPT so that I could get the game that I wanted. But let's see if Gemini can actually do its research on steel brain rot to make the game without me having to tell it what to do. Okay, so I'm going to copy everything here. So apparently I need to open up the command prompt. Yeah, so the command bar down here and I just need to paste this entire thing. Okay, so let's do that. Whoa. Damn! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. I was not expecting that. Can I play the game? I'm actually so curious. Can I play the game right now? Okay. We have some errors in the output, but look at this. We got some parts. Okay. How does this work? So click items to steal or pick up. If I uh, pick this up, it's um. okay. Well, it's not working. Also like these parts here are not despawning as well. Okay. So it looks like this is my base here. I have <laughs> bonk bat. I don't know what the heck this is supposed to be, but it looks like it's functional. Like it actually is working, which is surprising. Okay. This is already looking pretty good. I mean, this is not, this is not how the game works, but I, I clicked on one of the brain rots and now I'm moving them back over here. Oh, drop the item. Yo, I'm now making money. Hold on. Oh, well, I, I can't uh, pick this thing. Oh, wait, I can't pick this back up. I mean, this isn't exactly how steel brain rot works, but like, like, honestly, this is like a, an actual Roblox simulator. Oh, <laughs> what is that part doing? It just got flung all the way over there. What? I can just spam these uh, <laughs> these parts. Yo, look at this. I I'm trying to create like beautiful art here. Let's uh, see if we can make these fixes to the game because uh, there are quite a few problems here, but dang, Gemini really does take its time to think about these things. So this was in the span of 10 minutes. We still have 50 more minutes to make this game function. All right, so it is done. Let's copy this entire script, shall we? Version two, baby, version two. Uh, Gemini, do not disappoint me, please. Do not disappoint me. What the heck, heck is this? It disappointed me. It disappointed me. Okay, so there are no errors in the output this time. All right, I'm feeling pretty good about this. Let's go into the game and let's try it out. Oh my goodness, they actually have different models. We got new, new brought. <laughs> so we got new brought here. Yo, this thing is not getting off of me. Oh my goodness. I think I, I, I found a, a bug here. We got the Giga Chad for $500. Doesn't this look like Giga Chad? I, I feel like um the, the resemblance is, is quite there, you know, like... Uh, <laughs> this is what Giga Chat looks like. Whoa, 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 whoa. What just happened? I just pressed lock and it just locked my whole base, but also like squished me through the ground, bro. Oh my goodness. I am now forever stuck on the ground. What did I do to deserve this? What is happening with my character? Oh my goodness. This is not how the game is supposed to work. So technically, this is like a bare bone version of what a Steel of Brain Art game would be because you have a base and there aren't exactly slots in your bases, but you can still sort of put brain rots in your base and you can have other people steal them from you. So, you know, in technicality, this is what the game is. So, yo, why why does the Rizzler look like this? Like, is this supposed to be like it's low taper fade or something? Oh, look at this. I can spend my money on stuff. 
Okay, all right. Okay, so right now the the shop. <laughs> oh dang, I, I was actually so invested. Like the the shop looks like it was really good, but it looks like uh it doesn't even work anyways. So and we have about uh 23 minutes. So let's see how much we can get done. Eight hours later. I'm going to try buying a speed coil. <gasps> yeah, I got the speed coil. No way, I actually got it. But why does the speed coil look like that? This is not what a Roblox speed coil should be looking like. <laughs> Stealth potion. Yo, no freaking way. I mean, this is not stealthy at all and it's also a one-time use this is not what you call stealthy a, a player would definitely be able to see me but yo that's so cool i have gotten myself into a weird situation now i am forever stuck all right it looks like the time is up so it is time to see what gemini has whipped up okay let me show you what gemini has whipped up and what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to do a team test with two people first thing that's going to happen is once we're in the game you can see that there are these brain rots that are moving inside this little conveyor belt, just like how the actual game goes. We have Skibbity, we have a noob bot, I think that's what it's called, uh, and then we have Grimace. And basically what you have to do is you have to click on these, and you can click up to three brain rots apparently, and you have to carry them back to your base like this, and you have to drop them <laughs> by pressing G or pressing the button there. And then once they're inside your base, you are now earning money. So this isn't exactly how Steel Brain Rock works, but it kind of falls under a similar premise. We have rainbows and goldens. Oh, look, golden. So go look. OK, OK, OK. So as you can see, we have a golden noob rot. So these are more valuable and they come in at a rarer chance as well. Now, another thing that's kind of bad about this is that when I steal these brain rots, it doesn't actually take money from me, which is a problem. And finally, so my final thoughts on this is um, it's pretty good. I would say uh, this definitely won over ChatGPT, but it's still kind of not accurate to the actual game. Like I would not release this game. It's uh, it's pretty bad. But honestly, I would give this recreation like probably a five or a six out of 10. Like that's probably what I would give this. But yeah, this is Gemini 3 recreating Steel of Brain Rot in Roblox. Let me know what you would rate this in the comments. And also be sure to let me know what other AI or game you want me to recreate in the next video. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe